Hi, my name is Carlos Cruz. I'm one of the artists selected for the Julio de Burgos Support for Artists grant, supported by the Cuyahoga Arts and Culture. So I am, what I like to say, a digital illustrator, striving to really kind of challenge myself and try to get better at trying to get better at digital art. Like I started off with uh, graphic design like back in college, but I've always been really good at drawing. And so I wanted to see like how I can kind of do that just digitally because I do like how um, art is made on the computer. And so recently I started getting really involved in the gaming space and I'm starting to notice a lot of things going on in Cleveland that related to gaming and I started to ask myself how do those things start to work together. So when I saw an opportunity for a project I decided that I wanted to do something that captures a lot of leaders in the city um, of all different types of backgrounds and try to capture them in their connection with video games because I feel like that is something that all of us kind of have um, some sort of experience with. And so for my project, I want to assemble a collection of um, different illustrations of people around Cleveland and drawing them in the style of their favorite video games growing up. Um, the reason why I find that important is because I feel like video game art is very nuanced, it's very specific, and very unique. When you think about a video game, it's like, you know, art is part of like its signature image. Like, when I can think of many different video games, like some of my favorites being like Pokemon or like Sonic. Like, you know, all of which have varying art styles but are very iconic. And so, I know I'm, I know I'm not the only person that, you know, feels that way about video games, so I want to figure out a way to uh, capture that. The overall idea of this collection um, is that it'll be assembled into a sort of like a zine. Um, so like an art book, if you will. And as people are kind of like turning the pages, they'll see them see themselves, but like if they're reading about themselves, but if you're in the city, get to learn about other people that are also living in the city, learn about what some of their favorite things are, and seeing them in a light that really relates to things that they've grown up with. Um, I know growing up, some of my favorite things were like to read like uh, like an encyclopedia of my favorite superheroes and reading all about them, about the art style and stuff. I kind of want to have a, a similar feeling for somebody that opens up this scene and uh, reading about people that are really doing stuff out here in the city, um, but also kind of like really associating that with different art styles. It's a way for me to challenge myself but also to spread awareness about games culture. A little bit of, more about myself, like with experience with art, I uh, just started to really take it seriously within the last couple of years, but really like truly investing in my skills and, and really like started doing art for other causes besides just myself. Like I did illustrations for uh, Safer Heights, which is like a community organization that addresses uh, police violence against the black community in, in Cleveland Heights. And um, I was one of the illustrators for a zine that we published like through that organization. And it was really cool. It was really cool. And that showed me that I could really start to do um, illustration, not only like a political level, but a social level and, you know, all of those things. Um, and then aside from that, like doing commissions for other like, you know, gaming or organizations for different causes. And uh, aside from that, I'm also a streamer where I'll stream online, you know, actually doing my, my illustrations uh, for people to watch me on Twitch. Uh, and so the name of my brand is um, GLHF Carlos, which is good luck, have fun Carlos. That's what I go by on Twitch and on Twitter. But I also have an Instagram called Carlostrations, which is kind of like my art uh, brand. And so just a couple different things, but like uh, that's that's pretty much how I operate. Is like I, I want to be able to practice my art, really get better, um, you know, every time that I draw, but also kind of go through that journey with other people too. I just want to say thank you to the Julio de Burgos Cultural Arts Center and Cuyahoga Arts and Culture for making this opportunity totally possible.